to the vlog. Julia, say hi. Hi. Guys, how do you like my ride? It's <laughs> a van. Um, by the way, we're driving literally less than five miles an hour, which is sad, in the canyon. But hi, welcome to the Utah travel vlog video. Don't know what we're calling this, but we're stuck behind a car that's pulling an oversized load. So um, our luck is just phenomenal today. Let's let's give a little detailed story, shall we? So <laughs> getting, um, I had family guests um, staying in the house. So when my bag was oversized, I could not go get any other suitcases. Julia came to the rescue with a bag. We split it. It's in there somewhere. Um, I think that's a cop, just act natural. <laughs> um, so I get to the airport and I have my bag of things that's not packed. And I had to be super quiet this morning. My cat ran out of the house, so my dad had to chase her. Anyways, nothing went right, but everything went okay. I get to the airport, Julia comes, and then her sister gets a flat tire. Literally at the airport. I like felt so bad. It was from a road at the airport too. So anyways, um, we get on the plane, we take off, fabulous. We get 10 minutes early to the airport. The uh, gate is taken, so we have to wait. He's like, 15 minutes, so we're fine, okay. It was an, ended up being a little bit over 15 minutes. A little, it was like 45. I didn't even notice. <laughs> and he goes, sorry for the inconvenience. He's like, but I can't make this stuff up. Now they're having trouble. I think he called it the taxi, right? Yeah. Like the thing that connects to the plane. So he's like, I literally can't make this stuff up. I'm so sorry. So we sat in the plane for a long time. We ended up getting Shake Shack though, which was delicious. Oh, so um, and Starbucks, which Starbucks, the lady like honestly did not understand what I was saying in any sense. So she like got a mis mix up. The cherry on top is when we went to go pick up our car. We had a great Uber driver, she was sweet. Um, mm -hmm. So we ended up going, I had a reservation for a normal sized car. And we get there and he's like, mm, a little bit of a pickle. Um, this is the only car we have. <laughs> it's a van, it's not even like a minivan. It's like a van, like I am s bringing you pro, oh my God, that is so beautiful. Can you even see? Julia will show you at the next stream we're passing <laughs> there have been multiple streams um, story times so back to what I was saying we didn't know what to do I know that there's a shortage of rental cars so I was just like whatever we'll take it this says oil change required it's kind of low on gas we're like way delayed by what we wanted to do and like the timing we wanted to have and now we're stuck behind a car that's an oversized load. So it's just like really phenomenal here right now. Our day one in Utah has been nothing but pleasure. Oh, this is so beautiful. <laughs> so hopefully it only goes better from here, you know? But keep a smile on. We got this. I love how that Subaru tried to, I tried to let him go ahead of me because I thought he would be able to drive faster. And here he is stuck in front of me as well. So yeah, I'll update you guys later when something more interesting than this is happening, hopefully. Hey guys, all right, we did our makeup in the back of that van and you know, honestly, the more we live with it, I feel like the more we're not mad about it. Right now we're trying to get a shot of Silver Lake 
and then we have a dinner reservation in Park City, so it's a little complicated, but it's okay. We're getting it. Um, this is really pretty. I wish we had more time here, but unfortunately our first day got kind of back and forth, so we're just making the most of it, but really beautiful. Definitely photogenic. I can't see anything. We checked out the views at Silver Lake. It's beautiful. Super cute. I'm obsessed with the wood. I just like love tall trees. I'm all about the woods. So much to love here and to appreciate. These are my favorite trees. They look so beautiful and remind me of Ukraine. I, I came across something like this in Hawaii. Um, but it was it was just like this. There's not a single border on the road. <laughs> Oh my god, we are not driving in this end. Park City and we're visiting the St. Regis. Look at our meals. That's the Caesar salad. Crab cakes. The lovely Julia. Look how pretty she looks. No, it's the fourth meal. Oh my god, wait, you look so beautiful. Thanks. And then those are mussels or clams? Mussels. I can't tell the difference. I don't like anything in shells. It's just unnatural to me. The waiter didn't want to take no for an answer for the dessert, so he gave us these. Julia's videotaping it for memories. Are you ready to try? Cheers. Mm, good. They remind me of something. Mm. Cupcakes. The little cupcakes you get at the grocery store but in a chocolate. We made it to our Sundance Resort. The grounds are really pretty. I'll show you in the morning, but it's what the bathroom looks like. There's a steam shower. It's a one bedroom thing. There's a little room right there. You have a little kitchenette. You got your Julia on the bed. You got your table. You got a fireplace that won't shut off. That's, it's concerning. But yeah, we're like tired. Our trip was so long. So we're gonna shower, cleanse our faces, and get to bed. And I'll show you Sundance in the morning. But we made it here through struggles, but we made it. My ankles are swollen my again. My lip gloss did the same thing. Whoa. It's a lip gloss. Good morning, you guys. So it is now probably like 9 30 ish we woke up pretty early got ready um because we have a long day ahead of us have to go get breakfast hopefully we have time to go up the mountain and explore there then we're heading to is that like a giant thing of sh foundation like yeah. <laughs> i was like what is that right there <laughs> and got distracted and we're driving down to zion national park we're going to be staying at the Wildflower um, Glamping Resort, so that's gonna be fun. And then we're going to Bit and Spur for dinner. So hopefully everything works out. Um, I don't know, we're kind of, 
kind of frazzled, kind of everywhere, but in a good way. If there can be a good way like that. Sundance and then there's our van in the parking lot Julia quick interview question how do you feel about the van now okay, it's not that bad. it's a changing room on wheels you can kind of see the shadows but we are heading now to Little Sahara and first we're gonna do a quick stop at Target to get water because we are out. Oh my god, I almost just fell. Am I dumb? Oops. E daisies. Oh, fudgicles. I'm gonna need my, my charger. That's gonna be pretty convenient for the drives. I have um, my. Nearby? Yeah. So we just pulled over. It's the most beautiful spot. Julia suggested that we like pull over at the next spot, and this one just was chef's kisses i'm going to turn you guys around so you can see but we're in the canyon at sundance and we were driving this at night and it was literally pitch black like we didn't really see much but during the day it is so beautiful so worth it so if you're ever over here you have to pull over and take this picture look at how gorgeous i mean disregard the charger over here on the dashboard but like look how stinking gorgeous Amazing. There's a party downtown. Someone said that you're coming by. Let me know when you're here. Meet me up for a smoke outside. I regret what I said. Just hope that we're still okay You always pick me up and let me down So we just switched uh, positions. I was driving and then now Julia is. We are pulling up to Little Sahara. Um, I'm really excited to see what it looks like. Hoping there's not too many people so we could take some really cool pictures. I'm glad to see that there's no rain clouds. As we were driving there was some crazy, crazy rain clouds that like just looked like half the sky was really upset and like really dark and the other side was beautiful and sunny. Luckily we got to the beautiful and sunny spot so we're gonna go take some pictures hopefully, enjoy the sand, fingers crossed it's not too hot because it's like a little bit of a cloudy day. Um, but yeah, now our uh, van is telling us, it says, you've been driving for too long, you need to rest now. I'm like, the van doesn't know that there's two people in the car, but that's kind of cool that it like tells you like to rest. No one ever tells me to rest in life. <laughs> At least the car would. <laughs> Don't go fast. 
I did, I've never been in a sand, sandstorm. Oh, <gasps> Look, it's a, literally a sandstorm. What is this? It's a sandstorm. Cause it's just. I'm learning a lot of new things while we're here. Like things are flying through. Like that truck right there is about to disappear into that sand. Oh my god. It's, it's there and then now it's gonna be gone. Look. Oh my god, it's gone. Whoa. Keep it like really slow. Look at those gusts right there. Okay. Keep it slow and steady. Hold hold both wheels. Both hands on the wheel. Both wheels. <laughs> What is this? Like you can't see anything. If I looked at the weather, would it tell me that this is? I don't think so, because these are kind of a sudden thing. Just a second ago, I could see like all the fields, everything there, and then all of a sudden, it was just Kadoosh. a huge change. <laughs> wow. Well, hopefully, it blows over. We spent some time in Little Sahara. We took some awesome pictures. Um, now we're driving over to our dinner reservation. Um, we were gonna stop at the hot springs, but we ended up getting delayed, took a bit of time. Oh my gosh, another gust. Are you ready? Hold on, oh my god. <gasps> I literally, we can't, can't see anything. Oh my gosh. Like what is, I, nothing is visible. Nothing. I don't know if I like you, I don't know. Oh, 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 careful. Let's turn on these two, so people can see where we are. Wow, you can't see anything. Oh, nope, those are clouds. Yeah, my God. Is anyone else panicking? These people seem super chill. They're definitely Utahers. Utah, Utahers. Look, that truck is right in front of us, but it's so hard to see. Wow. Hopefully we make it to this appointment, uh, not appointment, dinner reservation, but we'll just say we got stuck in a sandstorm. <laughs> I got stuck in a sandstorm? Guys, look at this truck. I it's don't wanna, back. I don't wanna see this happen. It's back keeps swerving. He was going pretty fast. The gusts were literally pushing his, his haul into the other lane. I'm looking at the wind and it says the wind right now is 14 miles an hour. Is that, is that like? That's definitely not accurate. There's gusts because a 15 mile per hour wind would not move that across. Is he okay? What? Did I no, miss something? No, the road work signs. We couldn't keep our hands away from each other. You always pick me up and let me down We're spinning around, losing our minds Damned if we do, damned if we don't Damned if we give you know what we want And I always pick you up and let you down We're spinning around, losing our minds Damned if we do, damned if we don't Thank you.